outside of the congressional races, the Georgia governor's race has been one of the most closely watched. Republican Brian Kemp and Democrat Stacey Abrams are neck and neck in the results without a clear cut winner. Here's a look at the vote count right now from our sister station in Atlanta. In order to be declared the winner in Georgia, a candidate must get more than half of all votes cast. Otherwise, a runoff must be held. A third candidate won about 1% of the total. Both major candidates addressed their followers last night and suggested this is just the beginning. We are waiting on the final results, but I'm confident that victory is near. To all of Georgia's voters, including the 1.2 million who haven't shown up before, welcome aboard. But I want to say this, if I wasn't your first choice, or if you made no choice at all, you're going to have a chance to do a do-over. And on a national level, Press Secretary Sarah Sanders says President Trump was confident enough in Kemp's victory but he called to congratulate him on the win last night. But the candidates suspect the runoff will happen. Again, we are still waiting on official results.